Welcome back, and today we're gonna build this Nova again. But like I had two of these, so the last one built it as a light blue. So this time we're gonna build it like uh, a dark, some type of blue. So there's the body right here, and you got the interior and then half motor. Not gonna go through it uh, much today. Just a quick glimpse. Got a squirrel, suspension, hood, and dash, steering wheel seat. Frame. Here's your lovely chrome tree. Rims, grill, bumper, mirror. And then we got our tires. White roll tires. Our windshield, headlights, and telephone. Yes, we come with the telephone. Degals. And our directions that we don't care about. And, but what's going to be different about this one is um, hopefully it, if it'll work, but I'm going to put this 454, which this motor came from... Uh, that Nova that you guys have watched. And we'll put this in here and hopefully it'll fit. Just have to go find some more parts. So stay tuned and we'll come when we come back we'll show you what we'll be paints will be using. And hopefully you guys have digged the intro. And then we'll get into our first build update. Okay, here's the uh, paints we'll be using and stuff. A gloss true blue for the body, and then a matter finish, which is a flat black, but matte black, but I call it matter, just to be joking around. So that's what I'm be calling it for now on in my videos matter black. For the frame and interior, and just in case, if this motor don't work out, I'll paint this orange and take a chrome sharpie right here to the motor and orange right here. And I'll put it in with a, I got a hobby knife, I got a, my trusty pliers, razor blade knife, glue we'll be using for the uh, the, the windshield and the back glass and our goal. And we got a flat to do the, the uh, to do up under the body. Okay, now when we come back, we'll get into our first build up. Okay, here's the first build update. We got the body painted. Uh, I'll get back paint up underneath. Got the steering wheel done. Dash, almost done. I have to do it like this, but <laughs> and I'll put decals there. I might show you right before I put the dash in. This is painted, all that. The framework got the exhaust system taken with a done with a chrome trophy, and I'll put these in for the front tires. And I've already test, done a bunch of test fitting, and the motor works. So we'll go with it. So we do not need you. Throw that away. Not, not really. Always safe parts. And I got, I don't know, at, doing the test fan, I don't know if my manifolds will fit. But I got my air cleaner painted. And I got the fan uh, system put together. And. On here, it's kind of tight in there. So when we come back, we will have our second belt update. So stay tuned. Here is the dash. Got the decals in. Here's our second build update. Got these tires together. They were hard just like the last one. Got no finish motor all put together. And... After doing a bunch of test fitting and testing, I'm going to have to put the body onto the frame. 
and then put the motor through because it's basically how I have to do it. Because if it's on here, I can't do nothing. So, then I got the interior in, that telephone, squirrel, painted, all that, and, and windshield in. That all I have to do is put tail lights in, get headlights onto the grill, that's already black wash and painted, put tail lights on the mirror, put tires on, all that, and then I'll be done. So, I'll will be i'm gonna go put everything on together and when i'm done we'll come back so while you're waiting please subscribe and if you want shout outs comment down below okay here it is finally this 1963 chevy tuned over station wagon it's done I decided not to put the mirror on, looks very nice, I think, better than the previous one I built, you know, I screwed up on the things, but, there's a burning, and there's actually a motor this time. Looks pretty good with the motor <laughs> and not a half motor. So at the end, I'm gonna do a show, show pictures with this car and another car, and I'm gonna tell you which car looks better. And and also, if you could tell. Maybe need good from the side, but yeah, there's a squirrel and a telephone there. He's talking to his buddy and the other Noah and my mom and Pupples. But this one's staying alive. Happy you like this video. Please go like, comment, subscribe. And if you want to see more videos like this, tell your friends. If you want shout outs, comment below. And what truck or car should I do next? Tell me, please. And stay tuned for the next video. And by the way, I built this all in one day. I built this in like maybe six to eight hours. With the paint dry and all that, so yeah. Okay, stay tuned for the next video.